morning guys. It's super early. <laughs> Canyon is kind of asleep still. I just put the binky back in his mouth because he was crying, but he's like pretty still right now. Welcome back to my channel. This is the most ugly lighting I've ever seen in my life. Holy cow, I look bad. Um, yeah, it's like 5.30 in the morning. We are going on a trip to Santa Barbara. So yeah, our flight leaves at 10. We have to get to the airport at like, I'm gonna say by 8.30 at the latest. We're gonna leave our house at like 8.10. And so, well, I can't, I'm talking really slow. <laughs> I don't even know why I started the vlog right now, but I was like, I'm gonna show you guys what it's like to travel with a baby. That's my goal. I did a lot of the packing last night. I have like a few things left in the dryer. I ordered like a bunch more onesies off of Gap, Old Navy, and Amazon. That all kind of were like just got delivered and so I washed them. And yeah, packed up almost everything last night. I was gonna do a packing vlog, but it was just too hard. So another time I'll show you what I packed to go out of town with Canyon. But um, yeah, I'll show you like how we do the airplane ride and everything. Not really next for it's my first time. <laughs> Oh my gosh, yes, he's back asleep. Okay. So I wasn't planning on getting up till like 6.15, but he woke me up at like 5.20. And I was like, oh, more time is never a bad thing. I could go back to sleep, but probably shouldn't because we're probably going to be running late knowing me. So got myself a few extra minutes. Sit and have my coffee. Oh no, he's stirring. He heard me say I was sitting and having my coffee. I can always hear you when you're sitting. Anyways, maybe get my makeup on and then... And then feed him. We'll see how many more minutes he gives me. Oh, he looks very awake. Oh god. Wait, no, he's asleep. This is the story of my life. I can't get anything done because I just stare at the stupid monitor. <laughs> Any other moms? I'm much more ready. Put on a little bit of makeup, comfy outfit for the airplane. Um, just pumped a bottle um, because I heard some mom say it was like, wait, their baby what am I saying? I heard some mom say that their baby did better with bottles on airplanes versus breastfeeding and I know it's gonna like hurt his ears especially the very first time so um I'm just gonna have everything available like we'll try the bottle if he doesn't want it I can breastfeed him um but yeah definitely want to have options so I'm bringing one pumped bottle and then I'm also bringing um, another bottle that just has like water in it and formula. We don't really use much formula, but like he does have it occasionally. Um, so just as like a backup, I don't know if something happens to this. I just like want to be really prepared. I portioned out a bunch of formula for the weekend, um, just like as a backup because um, I am going to be having my dad watch him, and so I'm going to pump and leave milk. But like it's just good to. I just like to have formula on me for like an emergency. I don't know why. Probably just because I'm a new mom. But um, yeah, I already packed this with water. So you are allowed to bring liquids through TSA for your baby, but they will fume test it. So anyways, you can look more about that online, but I have gone through TSA with my breast milk already before and they were really nice. All right, we have to get ready. I have to wake up Canyon and get him dressed. So we can get out the door. I'm basically just bringing my diaper bag as the care, as my like carry-on. I'm just gonna put like my wallet and phone and everything in the diaper bag. So I don't have to carry like a purse as well. Um, I'm also bringing a photocopy of the birth certificate just in case. They need some identification for him. We don't have his passport yet. We're not going out of the state right now. Or out of the country, I mean. But just in case they want to see something with our names on it. And his, I don't know. Got the birth certificate. Um, got a sound machine. Lots of burp rags in here. Um, I put a binky clip on the webinar. This is his favorite binky, but it, I hate that it always falls on the ground. So I just like did this like makeshift. Um, I got extra blanket, obviously a lot of diapers, wipes, um, extra outfit. Yeah, beanie in case he's like really cold. I have like hand sanitizing wipes. Um, I'm still using nipple shield when I nurse. So I have like two nipple shields in these cases. So he ended up waking up 
And then I just like fed him and put him in the swing and then he fell back asleep this whole time so I could get ready, which was amazing. Um, but now I'm gonna wake him up, get him dressed, and we have to leave in like 15 minutes. I put the car seat in this bag that I got on Amazon and I had brought one for the stroller, but this guy, Brian, he brought his golf clubs to check and his golf clubs didn't have a top cover. I don't know. I don't know what his plan was, but we had to use the, uh, the stroller bag for the golf clubs. Canyon has been a perfect angel. He would, did not cry at all. Um, TSA took forever. There was a huge long line to check the, like my milk and everything, but we're about to board. He couldn't quite make it to take off, but we should be taking off soon. He was getting really hungry. A little bit hectic, but we made it. Brian literally abandoned the stroller to come pet this dog I mean, right I now. I put the parking brake on. <laughs> you left your kid. This is a nice, nice dog though. We're getting ready. We're in our Airbnb. I did not do a tour, but we're gonna go do on a tour, walk. Do a tour, do a tour, do a tour. Well first, let's start outside. So, this is the Airbnb. We've already kind of made it a mess a little bit. Um, the kitchen is really cute. I love it. Little seating area. Getting ready for the walk, dad mode. Boy in the corner. There's Canyon Boy. The living room is nice. This is a two bed, two bath. So there's one of the bathrooms over there. And then we set our stuff up in this bedroom. And then there's another bedroom. They're like identical, pretty much. I think the other one's a little bit bigger. And then there's another bathroom over here. And then we're back in the kitchen. But everything's like very cute and nice. And it's so beautiful out. We are going to go on a little walk, but Cannon's been like laying, I feel like a lot today in the stroller because mm. we went to lunch and he slept in there for like two hours. So we're gonna put him in the carrier just so that he can like exercise his muscles a little bit. Are you ready, Dad? Mm -hmm. this is our I like this outfit, it looks like if I'm Gonna break in and steal a baby all black, you know, <laughs> like I'm a baby heist guy. This is our first time using this thing, so. Is this how it's supposed to be? Yeah. One off. This like, top part could be, yeah. could be a little tighter up here. Where? I don't know. For it's his head? Good. I think it's good. Yeah, like that. A little. Just a little. More head support. Yeah. But he's pretty strong, oh, so yeah. we can let him like look around. Okay. Hand me a golf club. That's what I've been saying. Nah. Too much. Too much in your front? Yeah. Maybe if this is a back be all right. Well, once he gets bigger, you're allowed to wear them in the back, on the back. It goes on the back. Right. We're not gonna like this. Let's put the binky in. Okay. <laughs> anxiety levels are high. Let's go. My anxiety levels are zero. Well, you're the one acting stressed. Got the cup holder. Let's buy a big water. He's like half asleep. He likes it. The Mountain Dew is not the aesthetic. This is not the aesthetic, babe. I know. Put it on the bottom. It's really throwing Sorry off my stroller game. <laughs> yes. <laughs> this is a very famous like ice cream place in Santa Barbara. I can smell it from back there. It smells really good. It's probably the cone. Oh yeah. We're open wine tasting this way. I just want a glass of wine, honestly. We can pop in with our stroller. I can wait. No, it's <laughs> not how it works. What is this? Oh, Indian food. I would have gone in 
to the wine tasting place, but it looked a little dark and like not inviting. All right, this is my official first mom's day out. McKenna's back there doing with her hair. With none other than McKenna. I don't know if you've been on the channel or if it's just been like forever, or if you ever have. Maybe like years ago, like one of my first videos. But anyways, I'm in Santa Barbara, which you already know that from earlier in this video. But we're going um, to like the funk zone and wine tasting and lunch. And honestly, we don't really know. I don't even know where to put you guys. But anyways, I'm gonna take like some vitamins. So what do I do? Okay, so you just um, like take off the top. Mm -hmm. Like a shot? Yeah, take it like a shot. Okay. It's like a pouch shot. Does it taste bad or good? Or, oh. Well, it's like fine. I don't think I've told you guys like why I'm coming to Santa Barbara, but I used to live here. I went to college here. This was my college roommate, my bestie. And we're doing kind of like a reminiscing nostalgia weekend. And this is where we agreed that we should live together. <laughs> yeah, we, we had prickly pear margaritas. We were like set up on a blind date. We were like 18. <laughs> <laughs> we used our fake IDs. And we went to this restaurant. We sat like right here outside. Yeah, we did. Oh my gosh, prickly pears. Yeah. Another time. And that's when I was like $30 in my bank account. <laughs> and then I texted my parents and I was like, I'm going to meet this girl that I might live with. Like, I need money for dinner and drinks. And oh my so gosh. I, like, have them transfer money into my account because I like definitely couldn't afford to like go to dinner. That is so funny. But that was how we basically like. But it was our like life. Taco Tuesday or something, so it was like two dollar tacos. That's why we. That's why we went there. Yeah, we were like, like really cheap. It's on sale. And I still <laughs> needed money to be transferred. By <laughs> Strolling through the streets. Now we're like, like oh, do you want to go to the fancy place we could never go to before? Well, should we buy a bottle to bring back to our Airbnb? <laughs> Times have changed. We've grown up. True. And like we didn't live here after college, like we left. I feel like the funk zone was like just kind of building up. When and we it was here. like all the people who just graduated who liked it. Yeah. Like we, we were not mature yet. enough, honestly. We didn't want to like come sit and enjoy wine and talk about life. We wanted to black out and not we remember were like, life. Where are the boys at? Yeah. <laughs> we know people here. <laughs> Do we say hi or not? I can't, I'm embarrassed. We get it says no. I think their boyfriend's looking at it. We're moving on to the next destination. We're going to Llama Dog. Remember that we went there with all her roommates? No. Like the weekend we moved out? I was probably drunk. No, there's a picture on my Instagram. I'll oh, show you. Then I probably remember. Maybe, was my leg broken? Yes. Yes. I broke my ACL. I have not been any amount of light in so long. This is so fun. Sorry if this is like shaking everywhere. 
Lead the way, Gerd. I think I want to buy something. What do you want to? Oh, I was gonna get a bottle. Oh, we forgot. We'll go get it. We'll go get it. The it's Happy fine. Canyon. There was wine. Yeah, it's called Effin Happy Canyon. Yeah, there was a wine bottle. The makers were called Happy Canyon, and I was like, that's my kid's name. I have to get one. <laughs> Sorry if this vlog is just like me being like a little bit Or my lit. double chin. <sighs> They're used to it. Anywho, the Fest Parker. The boys have been. Remember the Fest Parker? We went here. Whatever. Yeah, why? Let's go right. Looks boring right now. Anywho, the boys have been golfing all day. Dog. Now they're gonna meet up with us. And we're going to Llama Dog. Turn. Everyone here is so nice. Howdy, howdy. <laughs> oh goodness, my fucking pants. Thanks for coming so along for this ride. Up. Okay, bye. Come on. mind. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna make them have an oyster. <laughs> I'm having an oyster. An oyster like shooter. Make them have an oyster. Senses fit. Yeah, olive baby. oil. Oh, look at him. He's so cute. He wants Some to sit Some sand as olive oil for the pasta. Yeah. yeah, because we do the pasta. He ruined every fucking he Sean, ruined every fucking we're, club we're here for oysters, baby. What's up? I brought three oysters. Anyway, I brought three here for the oysters. How's Sean? Sharon. Sharon, yeah, Sean. Sharon. 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 Mumble. Sean, Sharon. Mumble. Sharon. Mumble. Nice to meet you. We'll be here. End of month. Yeah, yeah. Tyler. Tyler, nice to meet you. Remember, every back time in the I, day. So yeah, the last time I saw these girls, they were like 20. 20? Fucking yeah. kids. Like, I'm 27 years old. That's crazy. I got a baby. I'm getting married. It's fucking I know. crazy. That it's is crazy. crazy. Nice to meet you too. What's your name? Brian. Brian, pleasure, man. <laughs> the only person hey, that, that will so take cool. a shooter with We're me is Taylor. Baby. My dad. Mommy and daddy <laughs> came. Mommy, yeah. For the boys? No, it's me and her fiance. We're not together, but. It's a watermelon and shooter. So You're going to like it. It's an amazing. Don't lemon juice, watermelon. You just take it back. Take it back like a shot. Eat it. Take it back like a shot. Eat it. Because it has a color for the whole thing. Yeah, like just chew it up. Yeah. Like give it a little spin. Take a watermelon in there. Okay, shoot it back. To honor. To Shut up. Oh, That's why you end up with a kid. <laughs> no, no baby. Only if you come on her, though, right? Yeah, you just. No, Brian will have, you have to five cut that more. Out of the video. <laughs> we'll do that oh. in post. <laughs> Shoot it back, baby. Shoot it back. Take it. Yeah, he likes it. There's good flavors in it. Right? And he takes it. <laughs> really good. You perverse. Really good. Really yeah, we're uh, we like all come from really Vogue. Come on, we're not normal. Like we're walking on the pier. We did the cold bear plunge every year. Look who it is. That sign says no diving head first. Yeah. No diving or jumping. Oh, jumping, fine. What about cannonballing? You gotta jump somewhere where you can. <laughs> As a profession. <laughs> uh, Alright, it was a good weekend. Did you have a good weekend, Canyon Boy? Yeah? <laughs> We're headed home. How was your weekend? Good. Dad's tired. So, what do we get? He was a perfect boy, though. You're looking at an absolutely perfect plane boy and vacation boy. <laughs> he was excellent. I'm just gonna feed him this bottle as we're taking off. Wow. Yeah.